Hello, you beautiful souls. So I'm here for another energy intuitive update. And it's much of a... It's a war. <laughs> it's a war. A war that they lost and that you won. Um, and it's just really wanting... You know how they say that the devil never sleeps. And at the moment that you decided you are moving, you're already walking that way, uh, they come in and try to uh, get you for one last time, right? So you're going to see that. But your mind, your body, and your soul, they already are aligning with oneself. So it's pretty much a done deal. Um, and I think that you just have to just move forward with with your action, your course of action, and that is simply doing you, right? Um, but not to say that you're not going to feel that this energy that you are feeling, the energetic pull, the debris of the energies that you have left, um, but know that, you know, it is, it's over, it's, it's over, it's a done deal for now, and, you know, you have somewhere else to go, and some other place that you need to be in that you're being called to uh, with this you kind of that's how the collective works and how the awakening process works right um, when one door shuts door uh, closes the door on someone a uh, new door opens and it it's infinite it, it, it has endless possibilities um, so this can trigger somebody to really look at themselves and say, you know what, oh my god, I need I need to change something, right? And it's just like a chain. You know, that's why we are like a blanket in the collective. We all hold a thread in the and we hold it together uh, to make this big conscious mass awakening, right? So it is like the domino effect. It is like the snowball effect. Um, so if things are happening, think people are awakening, people are unnoticing that, you know what, I don't have to deal with this. And you know what, I'm moving forward. Uh, regardless, I think before what was holding you back, all of a sudden now you're like, oh my God, I can't believe I was, I didn't let it go anytime sooner. <laughs> But you remember divine timing is always at play and, you know, you are open. You get to see things that you didn't really um, see before. And say they might have been right there kind of in your <laughs> existence, but literally not much. Um that you just couldn't right until now so divine timing always puts things where they need to be and will let you see it when you are ready and trust me you are ready because you you're definitely walking the vision that i have is a, a woman so this can be a feminine energy of course right so anybody can carry this everybody has the energy the feminine energy and she is walking with, you know, suitcases. It's not many, but with suitcases, she, she is going. You know, she's going on this adventure, and she's pretty happy. Um, so that's the message that I have. And as I'm doing this, is 444. Uh, so that is something that I felt intrigued and felt called to. I'll let you guys know. Much love, and like again, I said 444, four, four, so that is a beautiful meaning. It is very synchronistic in knowing that you are on the right path. All right, my friends, until next time. Namaste.